Okie okay, doke, uh, just a quick video as to how to export faces from Inventor for laser cutting. So, um, this can apply to any project, but specifically for this project, the Yaturn Pinball. Uh, if I want to laser cut these pieces here, uh, these outline shapes, I'm going to right click on the shape that I would like. And it will come up with a little drop down. And I'm going to click on export face as. And I'm just going to save it into a folder where I can access it. So I'm just going to save it into year 10 test and just save it as um, laser cut test. And it will save as a DXF file. Nice and easy. Obviously, if you have multiple of the same, you only need to do it once. Once that is saved into somewhere that I can access it, I'm going to open up 2D design. Now, this will have to be done on a school computer unless you've downloaded it at home. And I'm going to press import file rather than open. We're not going to press open. We're going to press import file. And I'm going to go and find the file that I just saved. So I'm going to go into my OneDrive and go to year 10 test. And I'm just going to click on that. Press open. And we made our parts in millimeters. So we're going to make sure to click this box millimeters. Now on 2D design, you can just drag these around, obviously, because it's being laser cut and cut out. doesn't really matter the rotation. If I have multiple, I might control C, control V. And it's really important that you tessellate and nest this into a corner to reduce waste when a laser cutting. So I could rotate it as I wanted to. I'm going to get it so the angle lines up nicely against the other one. And like that, I could then control C, control V again, and just tessellate them over and over again until I'm quite happy that I'm not reducing. Uh, not producing too much waste and that's pretty much it and then that's ready to laser cut so that's how to export a face as a dxf file and import into 2d design